Yeah, I'm in another nightmare patch job. Let me show you all these patches that I have. So I have that, comes up there, comes across the ceiling here, all the way across, down there. I have patches there. These are patches. I have all these light box patches on the ceilings there. There. So this is this wall here is uh, is pretty much new and that wall there. But this is all patched up. This I have this here. Uh, right there. And then and then this here. This is a big gap right here. Uh, but I'm gonna show you how I fix that too. Um, and then this was supposed to be wrapped. This was supposed to be a wrapped opening. So I'm, I'm about to hang that drywall. I'm about to start prepping everything, get ready for Durabond. I'm gonna pre-fill it then, and then I will, uh, I'll, I'll get this tape today. But I just wanted to, uh, what I'm gonna do is come right back to you as soon as I have it prepped for Durabond. All right, I'll be right back. All right, I have it prepped and ready for Durabond, but I just wanted to show you a couple of things here. Shut this fan off. It's making a lot of noise. Okay, I've seen it. I've seen guys take these and just pull them out. This one got pulled out. Let me find my six. This one, this one got pulled out, so it's got a big hole here, Let me, right there. But this one's not pulled out yet. This has still got the little blue dolly in there. Guys, hang on. Uh, just tap it in. Don't, don't pull it out. That gives you something to mud to. This hole is going to be very, very difficult to mud because it's, it's a big hole. And if they're too big, if they're too big, I like to just take a piece of mesh tape. You know what? I did it in the closet here. So this was a good size hole there. And and yeah, I could work on it and, and put mud in there and try to get that to fill in. But I can throw a piece of mesh tape on there, fill that in with Durabond, and it's it's ready to top. As soon as that Durabond sets up, it's all ready to top. So, so let me show you what I've done now. Okay. If you notice, I stuck mesh tape on those seams around there, but I did not do the mesh tape here. I didn't do it across these seams here, but I did do all of the patches. I've got all these patches mesh taped up. That one, let it focus. That one, um, this one here actually. I missed this one. I missed this one, I have to do that still. But I did that. I got this ready for Durbond. That's all mesh taped up, ready for Durbond. That right there. And then just that seam. And that little seam, notice I didn't do this one on this side. I'll tell you in a second. I, I put mesh tape around all of these holes so I can fill those in. I did that patch right there with mesh tape. Okay, but not the seams. And I did this one with mesh tape all the way around this big cutout patch right there. Now, why didn't I just mesh tape everything? Because it'll crack. If it's going from wall to wall or floor to ceiling and I mesh tape it, it's gonna crack. It has every time. I've gone into many houses where they just did mesh tape everywhere. Pre-filled it, did it. Did it just like they, they say they're supposed to. And I can see every seam cracked throughout every ceiling, every wall seam. So if it does, if it goes from wall to wall or floor to ceiling, I do not mesh tape it. I just pre-fill it. I tape it with paper tape. 
I don't have cracks at that point. But if they're patches and repair work, then I just patch them. So, and you see this big gaping hole right here? I'm going to take that with this stuff. That stuff right there. That's a big hole. That's, and I have one more down here. My entire fist fits in this hole. And I'm just going to patch it with that. It'll be hard. I'm going to put a I'm going to put in the words exactly how I pre-fill this, prep it, pre-fill it, and then tape it and and what I do. So, um, all right. You guys have a great day. I'm going to show you what I've got after I get it all pre-filled. Hey, if you really like the videos, subscribe. And if you really, really like the videos, please just share them with somebody else. All right, you guys have a great day.